on the Hydra's back! Because you know, here at the Clueless Boys, we love getting head. We're all about lore, and we're all about Hydras, and like you said, we're all about that head. We're all about that head. About, about that, that head. head. About no that head. anal. We're all about that <laughs> It might feel better on the way out than it did on the way in, which it felt pretty good on the way in, so I'm not sure how it could, you know, beat that, but anything is possible with the power of God and fingering. God can touch me in more ways than any other man ever could. God has touched me in more ways than any other man ever could. Oh, the, the, the only kind of tits you want. The, those the fucking big, big old mommy knockers, I'm saying. Those mommy milkers. Those mommy milkers. Those definitely bring all the boys to the yard. And they're like, it's better than yours. Damn right, it's better than yours. They could teach you, but uh, mind you, they would have to charge. Because damn right, it's better than yours. Damn right. I love this track. Jesus Christ. God damn. Yeah, so, so many good moves, and I can't do any of them because I don't got the AP for it. You hate to see it. That's why. Once I get those nine more AP boosts, we'll, we'll, we'll be getting them. I'll, I'll, be, I'll be full of abilities. I'll have so many abilities, you wouldn't even be able to see the end of the goddamn list. Those will be two times as long. It'll be much longer than my insignificant penis, uh, which I could hope could fill this lock in Megara's heart. Hello, everyone. Hi. Welcome to the insignificant, I mean, 11th episode of Kingdom Hearts 2. Whoa. 11? I can't believe it. We've come so far already. And lost it all. And in the end, you know, it turned out it didn't even matter. Because we had to fall to lose it all. Exactly. And now we're dead. We killed ourselves. How, how, what's his name? Chester? How, did he hang himself? Yeah, he hung himself. Well, uh, may, maybe we'll have, find a noose right here when we go to rescue Meg. That goddamn ugly bitch. One of the few times in media where, where a woman named Meg is actually hot. Yeah, she's actually pretty hot. Except for that one episode of Family Guy where they're in the alternate universe and Meg is super hot. Then that's, you know, that, that's an alternate universe. We don't talk about that. Holy shit. Maybe they should have done this to Han Solo in Star Wars. Maybe then they could have got him out. Yeah, put it, uh, locked his soul away within the Carbonite instead of his physical form. Un tegabinta solo and all that good Whoa! nonsense, you know. Almost there. Yeah, let's get in there. Into that giant dazzling gleam of green light and see what there is to be found. Meg. Ooh, hot lady. Damn, she is busty. <laughs> It's the dress that gives it away. Nah, she got a bust like that th that ain't been Jeez, seen since ancient now. Greece. You know what I'm saying? Nah, have a nice time. No, I've never been to ancient Greece. No. I've seen the musical. Oh, you see the musical? Not, not, not even the movie adaptation with John Travolta. No, the, 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 the musical version. Oh shit! Yes, Nick, because I like to sing and dance. I know it may be surprising and weird to you, but it's my hobby. It's my passion. You may call me a Nancy boy. You may call me a fruity fairy, but it's my life. And I'm tired of being judged for being myself. Fruits are good, god damn it. Yeah, Valor form. Yeah, I bet you miss this Caesar. Oh. Valor form? Yeah. No, you know what I miss? What's I miss that? the McRib from McDonald's. That's what I miss. I don't know why that's not just a full time item. Everyone would buy it all the time. Why is it seasonal? McDonald's, you know, they're a shit brand wall to wall, but they can make so much more money and more quality good money aside from their regular blood money they normally make if they just made the rib full time. I don't understand it. You see, Nick, it takes a lot to get that meat packaged. Yeah, that, that probably is some actually high quality, not high quality, but like better brand meat than what they put in their normal burgers, you know? Oh, most definitely. You gotta remember, too, they put in those thick onions. Mm. Oh, do they? I've never yeah. had them before, I don't know. Oh, yeah, they put in some, some nice thick pieces of, like, uh, onions, and then uh, uh, one small, skimpy, thin piece of lettuce. But it's <laughs> fine, because nobody why, really likes why, lettuce. Why any lettuce on, on that fucking thing? But I guess to make you feel like you're somewhat healthier than you actually are. It's like it's like when you go to a restaurant and you get something lettuce wrapped. It makes you feel healthier when it's really not. Yeah, you, you can get you, a double bacon cheeseburger on a lettuce wrap and it's still going to make you feel like shit. But hey, it's lettuce wrap. You can get a barbecue chicken wrap with fucking uh, finely roasted barbecue chicken, barbecue many. sauce, sriracha, some fucking uh, uh, what are those little, little Fritos tortilla chips and still call it healthy because it's a wrap. I know because I do it. And it doesn't make it he any healthier when you dip it in buffalo ranch either. Oh my god, but it makes it so much better. I know. So much better. So much better. Also, Pete has horns? I Pete Pete has horns? No, he's a dog. No, it's his ears. It's his ears. That's what. It's his ears. Okay. The inside of his ears is gray. I, that's, I was like, what the fuck? But no, he's fine. I'm gonna show these guys what happens when they mess with a true hero. They get fucked. Yeah. Flex your massive pecs at him. No, since Kingdom Hearts is now on uh, PC, and it hasn't been ever before, we no, don't talk about the Epic Games version. Cool. But now that Kingdom Hearts is on PC, someone could officially make a Johnny Sins mod 
for uh, Hercules here, and in every single game, they can have a Johnny Sins Hercules. So I, I'd, I'd pay money I for that mod. I'd, I'd pay a lot of money for it, but Look, uh, sadly, uh, Nintendo, or not Nintendo, Disney, they, they'd probably then sue that we'll guy for, for making money off it. Oh, a thousand percent. But someone, out, out of the generosity of their hearts, they could make a Johnny Sins mod, and maybe even a mini Johnny Sins mod for Donald right there, since he's not wearing pants ever anyways. Why not have just a giant male Johnny Sins hog on him? I'd love to see it. I, in fact, I would, I would endorse it. Imagine Herc right there, just a giant schlong hanging out of that skirt. Well, it'd be funny. They, uh, you know why? Yeah, that it's just hanging, dragging across. <laughs> and the then floor. what if they give him like tits? Like it's a giant pigs, they, oh, giant pigs oh. give him tits. Just giant, like, like, like a uh, Skyrim mod size tits. You know the tits I'm talking about. Oh, the, the, the only kind of tits you want. The, those j fucking big, big old mommy knockers. I'm saying those mommy milkers. Those fucking mommy milkers. Those definitely bring all the boys to the yard. And they're like, it's better than yours. Damn. Damn right, it's better than yours. They could teach you, but uh, mind you, they would have to charge, because damn right, it's better than yours. Damn right. Wow, I'm fucking this guy's ass up. Holy yeah, shit. Pete's never anything to worry about in a boss fight. He's yeah. kind of a bitch. So yeah, Hercules makes a shield that can fall from the falling rocks. When he gets in the orb, he can do a reaction command. Kingdom Hearts shuffle, it flings him into Hercules. He breaks it so you can hit him. Always, in any sort of boss fight, the Kingdom Hearts shuffle is going to come into play, and it's going to make the fight infinitely easier just like that. You, you, you. Look at that. We got Trinity Limit. That's one of the best moves you could get in Kingdom Hearts 1. In fact, I think it's one of the final moves you learn. Is it? Yeah. Hmm. But in this game, it's absolute shit. And, you know, I, I never use limits ever because they use all your magic, and I would rather use my magic on other things, like healing. Or the Valor form. No, because that doesn't use magic. No, what's the other one? Uh, does, wisdom. Wisdom does not use magic? Yeah, but I don't think you can do limits when you're in forms anyway. So it'd be one or the other. And I think oh. even if you're at zero magic, uh, if you go into a form that can use magic, like Wisdom or other ones later, it'll refill it automatically. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I see. Anyway, see you later, Hades. You can get locked down there with the, all the falling rubble like a dick bag. Good. And here we are, back to the 60 FPS uh, cutscenes. It's beautiful. It's It looks really fucking good. When I was editing the last episode, it looks kind of weird, actually, in that, in that cutscene as well. It was it was a little bit uncanny. I couldn't I couldn't put my finger on it. That's why you had to put all ten of them on it. Oh, yeah. I had to, I had to put all ten of my fingers on there. Just like we're going to have to put all ten of our fingers on this Hydra that apparently Hercules didn't kill because he's a dumb piece of shit asshole. There's never been a hero as shit as Hercules. Hey, well, could you have done better? Could uh, you have done better? Well, I'm about to answer that question right now by doing better. Watch this. Just fucking hold, 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 hold my tea while I do this shit. Oh, all right, I got your tea right here. Can I drink it? Can uh, I have no. a little sip? No, I put cyanide in there. I, I, I've been specifically dosing myself with cyanide so I could become, over time, immune to it. That way, in case uh, any of my future partners gets in a disagreement with me and wants to kill me uh, you know, secretively by injecting cyanide every day into my coffee, uh, they won't do it because I'll Jeff, be already immune. You're safe. Nick, I'm sorry to tell you this, but I already drank it. It's not your fault. Well, you got about... Uh, Unprotected. What was that like five seconds ago? Right. Uh, just, just about. Me. All right, now it's about Wash eight out. seconds now. You got about 24 oh, minutes on, and 32 Chad. seconds to live. I didn't train you to think like that. All right, well, I'm going to finish this episode, and then with whatever this time right. I have this left, no I'm going to enjoy myself. Up. There we go. I was going to say, just enough time to finish this episode. So Perfect. Cute. Guys, thank you so much for being <laughs> here with me for the for my last minutes I have left on Earth. Yo, we're going to do this now. Like, comment, and subscribe if you don't want Caesar to die. Please you, do you, it. usually a plug in the middle, but we're doing it now. If you don't. Then your favorite fat Mexican's going to have him. He's going to join Hercules up in Olympus, but he won't be fighting the Hydra. He'll be, you know, sucking its cock. Oh, yeah. Jesus, look at that pegging. What the fuck? Gee, my God. Mr. Hands, no. So he, had, he, he had some hands right there. Well, we got to fight the Hydra, Caesar. Yeah, fight him. Yep. But it's weird that a Hydra has one head. Shouldn't they have, like, eight? Well, Hercules didn't cut off its head before. He just beat the fuck out of it, you know? I know, but doesn't it have eight heads usually? Uh, I, I think it just starts with one, then as you cut it off, it, it, it doubles, or, yeah, it doubles them. Oh, okay. That's good. We, as, we, as always with the big boss, you want to use a Valor form of possible and get a bunch of fucking hits on it. Bam. And there we go, we cut its head off. Now, oh Caesar, my god. We get everyone's favorite Kingdom Hearts 2 memes. Get up on the Hydra's back. We didn't hear him say it, but I, I got up on his back too quick for Phil to say it. Oh, I thought that said the Urinator. It said the Urninator. Look at that again. Oop. The Urinator. Look, the, you, you, the Phil one too. Into the urinator. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the does urinator. it look like a urinator? It does look like a urinator. It just pisses on him. Shh. You get up on the hydra's back, you get the thing in it, and then he throws the thing down, and it makes these heads uh, dazed. Otherwise, they'd be all attacking you. 
So you do that, get them, and then you can defeat the heads one by one and make it get even more heads, as, like you said, is the Hydra lore. Bam. Because, you know, here at the Clueless Boys, we love getting head. We're all about lore, and we're all about Hydras, and like you said, we're all about that head. We're all about that head. About, about that, that head. head. About no that head. anal. We're all about that <laughs> All right, well, we cut off one head, it turned into three. We cut off three heads, and now it has... Uh, Holy shit, six heads. Uh, uh, one, uh, I think eight? One, two, three, four, five. I think it's eight. Yeah. If I can do it, yeah, quick count. One, two, three, four, five, six, yeah, eight of them. All right. All right. Perfect. The Hydra is, they, one they, for they, each of my dicks. Exactly. It's got uh, it's got two moves. It either does these uh, big shadow balls that come and track you, or it makes uh, like pillars of light come out and um, wherever you're standing and damage you. And oh. the, fur the further you are into the fight, the more... Uh, the faster they will be. So the less health, the less health it has, the faster they'll recharge. If you have the lasers coming out, they'll just go off instantly. Like is what is going to happen. Oh no, it's just a tail. Guys, don't remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. D d absolutely, don't forget. Don't forget, because remember, I'm dying at the end of this episode. <laughs> he's, he's currently dying as we speak. Yeah, as, yeah, as you can see, it's, it's health lower. Those, those those beams of light or beams of fire coming out much faster than they were. Yeah. But they already stopped, so it's fine. <laughs> And he's almost dead anyways, look at that. He's on his last bar. He's he's fucking nothing. Then once you get about about two of the phases in, the Kingdom Hearts Shuffle is gonna rear its head again. Kingdom and, Hearts uh, Shuffle. We're just gonna do it. We're gonna we're gonna do that sick nasty beat, and we're gonna do the Pegasus run to attack all eight of its heads and do a little bit of damage with each one done. What the fuck you? I've been mashing, I didn't miss that one. You're a piece of fuck you game. That's bullshit. Nick, come on. You got four of them. I have four. It would have been enough to kill it anyways. And you can't even kill it in the action command. If, if it runs out of health while you're fighting, it'll still be stuck at zero. It kind of sucks. Oh, well, that's not fair. Yeah, no. God damn it, Disney. Damn you, Disney. Damn you, Square. There we go. Dude, so, uh, uh, this, is, this is a bit of a side note, Nick, but uh, since we're talking about Disney, uh, well, I went to go do an open mic yesterday, and before that, they did a trivia thing. And one yeah. of the last questions in the final round was, what was the name of the wizard that helped Mickey in the in the movie uh, Fantasia? Yeah, it's Yen Sid. Yeah, I mean, in my mind, I'm like, oh, yeah, that's Yen Sid. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Was it? Oh, uh, yeah. All right, cool, perfect. Yeah. So I wasn't the... playing the trivia, but because I got right. there, I had to get there as it started to join, because oh, yeah. apparently they do five fucking rounds of trivia. Yeah, maybe it was the same trivia that I do. Yeah, it's five rounds. Yeah, yeah. And maybe I, I've kind of gimmicked the system a little bit where now they, they, they have it as a, every question is a minute long. But I find that's too much. People can look up answers. And even after like 30 seconds, most people have already answered. So I keep it like 45 seconds. And then like in the image round, I do 30 seconds. And I, I make it so it's more enjoyable, faster, and, you know, it's better overall. Yeah. Uh, that's reasonable. Yeah, if you do the full minute every question for all five rounds, it, then, then it does become – an hour 40 to two hours long. That's but the way I long. do it, hour and a half, I'm done out of there. Everyone's fine, happy. It's good and easy. Yeah. Just like that Hydra fight, good Don't and easy. Yeah. That can be a bit difficult on critical mode because, like I said, the lower its health gets, the more frequent its attacks become those magical ones. But Yeah. Hey, drink. She said the thing. But, um, yeah, it's not, not too bad. big deal. Just let us know if Hades or the Heartless start acting up. Let me know if James we'll Woods rears his ugly head again. You know, in the last episode, since we were talking about James Woods, what I'm glad you brought it up again. Yeah. Uh, you know how Let's I didn't know him from anything? Yeah. But now I do know him from road. something, because I watched a movie the okay. other day. Oh, yeah? Don't yeah, listen. and I didn't know he was in it. I was just looking through my free uh, you better, uh, YouTube so Prime like movie list. Yeah, yeah, and then yeah. this movie came up, uh, Once Upon a Time in America. Oh, all right. Yeah. And then I didn't know he was in it, so I watched the trailer. I'm like, oh, this is pretty good. And then I see see this guy i'm like hey that looks like james wood and i'm like oh yeah he's in here i'm like yeah i'll give it a watch the movie was fucking long it was four hours jeez four hours christ well it's 349 but it's basically four hours that, yeah well let me tell you man it was a fantastic movie was it a western no it was about a about a it was about it was a movie about a group of friends starting a gang in the 19 like uh like 19 uh, 1920s oh okay yeah Shit. It was uh, Robert De Niro was in it. Oh fuck! And James, well, he was the lead, Robert De Niro, and James Woods was the 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 co-lead, I guess. It was very beautiful. I'll have to check that out then. Holy shit! Oh, it's such a good fucking movie. Holy shit! It is the best, saddest, worst story you'll ever see about best friends. Yep. I, oh, oh my like, god! Like, like most gang type movies like that, it usually ends pretty terribly, as does the gang life. Oh yeah, but it fucking portrayed beautifully though. Oh yeah, hundred percent. If it's got those A-list actors, it's got it. The, the reason I asked if it was a Western is because uh, up until recently, you know, hey, we got Heroes Crest, one of the best Keyblades. Up until recently, 
movies weren't usually three hours or like an hour and a half to two until and fucking Scorsese came out like three hour long movies but there were three hour long movies back in the day and like the, from the 60s or early 2000s they're mostly westerns like Good, Bad and the Ugly or like um, other other type of spaghetti westerns or The Godfather the original one those were the, the long ones but, yeah four hours fuck me and I, 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 I would even argue that this movie was was better than The Godfather oh, I would oh, argue shit. it I would argue it All they're right. both fantastic but I think I might like this one just slightly more well then I'll definitely I have to go give this one a watch. It's My so earliest good. Earliest possible convenience. Oh, it's so good. Very well. I don't know if you had. Do you have YouTube Premium? Uh, probably, maybe, probably not. Probably, yeah, house. no. But I can probably find it somewhere else. Yeah, either you for, either for somewhere. free or uh, through illicit means. Yeah. Ooh. Just, big ooh. librarium. Wow. You think they read all those books? God no. No. Oh, Mice can't read. Hmm. Yeah. I where that old She's like, wow, they're colorful. I like these covers. It's Where's my old album? Yeah, Metallica's first album, self-titled Metallica. Where are you? God, look at her stare. She's like, God, stop talking to me. Shop thorns? Well, cut them, you fucking lazy assholes. What do I pay you for? Why don't I just hire a couple Mexicans to get in here? They'll do it tip-top shape. Chip, Dale, are you saying a couple Mexicans are better than you? Yes. I don't want to hear that, Chip and Dale. Now dance and start stripping. So true. It's like when Peter well, was growing that, that that farm in his basement, and he had those rats as like uh, like hostages there, growing oh, shit God. for him. He's like Pedro. It's that time of the month. I'm here to collect. It's like, Senor Griffin, we, we there's no sunlight. We can't grow anything. He's like, you know, Pedro. I got a lot of people waiting for the for this for this feed, and I can't wait no longer. Just give us another week. He's like, maybe we can make uh, an arrangement. Oh yeah, yeah. The, the mice. Yeah. He's like, John. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. He, his what, the, the mice's wife starts stripping. He's like, yeah, good. <laughs> oh man, oh, old family guy was great. So fantastic. This is your castle. Must be nice to be home, huh? Wow, this place looks like well, shit. Gears. You know, something just don't feel quite right. Yeah, Where's like, the sex slaves? <laughs> They're <laughs> usually <laughs> down here by now. <laughs> I brought my whip. <laughs> <laughs> I, I brought my bladed whip. It's got serrated edges for extra pleasure. <laughs> oh, no. I like to bathe in the blood of my victims before ejaculating in them, but that's just me, huh, <laughs> yuck? <laughs> you ever see guys use a whip like masterfully? That shit's terrifying. Yeah, or they do like the doubles. Like, yeah, it, it, it is pretty sick. It, it is pretty cool. I imagine getting hit by that. It had like a little blade at the end of that. <laughs> Would you rather learn dual whips for show or dual nunchucks? Ooh. Because I feel like the whips, the nunchucks would be cooler, but much more dangerous because it's a, a much higher chance of knocking yourself right in the noggin. Here's the thing. What if, what if I do one hand nunchuck, one hand whip? <sighs> That'd be like fucking tapping your head and rubbing your belly. That'd be quite a feat of dexterity if I've ever seen one. But if you could pull it off, I, I think that would allow you to, you know, get free admission to the bottom of the Bailey Circus. I think I could do it. Well, it takes a little bit of work, but I could do it. Yeah, like two, three weeks tops. You'd be a master in nunchuck, uh, the whip master, if I've ever seen one. Oh, yeah. Hey, look, another AP boost. <laughs> Almost at 20. Almost, we're at fucking 12 or some shit by now. I'm going to real quick just go around and get all this shit. That's uh, fine. Just because, oh, fuck, can't jump up there. There's quite a few puzzle pieces and chests around here with some decent shit. Also, lots of enemies around here. Should you want to grind a little bit? This is a good spot in critical mode to get a lot of basic materials because in critical mode you get two lucky luckies, like two or three right off the bat. So, get a lot of basic materials early on. Well, that's pretty good. But fuck these guys. Oh, right, also, new enemies. These are bombs. If you do uh, fire on them, all right, they'll start a countdown. And then uh, once they get to three, you can do a little reaction command and then make them explode. Otherwise, they'll explode on you and do damage. But I like it when they explode on me. You like when they explode all over you and they're dirty, they cover you in their dirty, heartless gunk. Mm hmm. That's the only way I like to live. I like living life dirty. Living life on the edge. Let's see. Should I? Nah. Mm, you know, uh, nah, I'm not going to do it. Fuck it. Yeah, fuck it. It's, when I was younger, I used to grind here for a bit and just kill all these heartless out here and out there to get some extra XP and grind some drive for them, but eh, it's not too necessary. No, but you could do it. We just got to get here and get this big ass item, which is map. You got a compass. It's the Torn Pages, actually. There oh, we shit, go. we could go do Weenie the Pooh's book. Yeah, you're right. We can put those Torn Pages in Weenie the Pooh's book and do an extra thing to get some more shit. I don't have a map yet. Did I miss it? I don't think so. Maybe she gives it to me. I don't know. Let's see. <laughs> I brought my whip, Minnie. Where's the sack slaves? <laughs> Minnie, where'd you put the sack slaves? I've been looking all over. Are they up in the chimney like you like to hide them? <laughs> I'll smoke them out for you. 
Sam, this is our friend Sora. <gasps> Sora! I've had wet dreams about you. you. About I'm glad someone dreams. has. He said you're a very Have you had any wet dreams man. lately, Nick? So no, I'm not meaning like wet dreams, like oh yeah. Like where I piss the bed, no, because that, yeah. that's more that happens much more often. No, I get right. you. Like like full on nut blown, right? Full on nut blown. Pre cum maybe, but it has to be a lot of pre cum. Yeah, I don't I don't think so. I don't think I've ever had, had, had a full on wet dream. I've ever had a pre cum before maybe, but never a full on full on wet dream. I had sex dreams too, of course, but never never to completion. Right. Well, so I'm that's like, the thing, you know, see. maybe a lot of guys are like that. Well, so I guess maybe we're just giving ourselves blue balls more chamber? often, right? Maybe, because I do experience it quite often. But that, is, that might be because I, I do give myself some testicular torsion I once in a while to, to get the get the gears going. Right. We must be sure what do you mean by testicular torsion? No, you just, you just grab it. It's like a little, like, 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 a, like a plastic bag full of dog poop. You know, you just grab it and you get the bottom and just spin it around. Yeah. I do that with my sack. Oh, you do? Yeah, yeah. Do you throw it over and, like, tie a knot in it? Yeah, I put over a girl's face and then I let it go and it spins just keep smacking her in the nose. Yeah, yeah, She loves it. I hope so. It's like clackers, right? That's what I do with my nut sack. I, I put my, my the wiener in between. Like, I stretch over the sack between the wiener. Yeah. And then I grab the sack and I play with it like uh, clackers. And then you do it right, right in your bitch's nose. I get that. That's pretty hot. I can see that. Yeah. All right, but we got Minnie right here. We can't do that to her. She's a princess. We're going to get uh, all the way down here to that door over there. If she takes too much damage, we'll fail. So let's not do that. Ooh, there we go. You can uh, press... Oh, fuck. You can press triangle to call her towards you, and to you, she'll stop whenever she gets to you. But if you keep running, she'll kind of follow you for a bit. And uh, let's just do that. Boop. Reaction man right next to her. It's like a big AoE that shoves shit away. It gives you a easier path forward. Oh, shit. Fuck you, bitch! And you also get invincibility frames during it, so it's, you know, it's basically free. Basically free. Just gotta get up here, do it right here, and you're done. Easy. No, well, she got a little bit of damage, Nick. Just a tad bit, but, Just you know, a tad bit. She, she's she a broke a nail. She's a silly woman who couldn't watch her feet, she couldn't take care of herself, so what do you expect? She's gonna take a little damage. Of course. It's a given at this point. <laughs> as soon as the Heil! started, I made sure to seal this For the room. real leader. <laughs> And a tiny door. Love a, love a tiny door on a big door. Now, hey, man. Sometimes you don't need that big door to open. Oh, we, don't, we don't have giants coming around here every so often. No, we, we just need a tiny little door for people to come in, you know, make them, make them feel lesser. We only open the big doors for big guests. This is a big open space. Holy shit. Full of heartless. It's a buffet of heartless. I got him. It's a smorgasbord. So this is also an instance where I'd grind. Uh, I would just kill all these guys because it's a nice little bit of XP plus, you know, some good materials should you nice, need them. Uh, nice but, chunk of change. Yeah, and they do give you some, some good, decent money once you kill them. I think it's like 50 gold per kill. 50 gold? Yeah, but you don't need it. Once again, you can just run down this whole pathway and then be fine. Oh, you bitch! There we go. Just gotta watch out for Minnie. Yeah, you don't want her to break any more nails, Nick. Definitely She's not. the princess. You gotta take care of her. She's already lost a couple inside me, so... Yeah, I'm going to shit those out eventually, but it's not going to be a fun time. Well, maybe you'll actually like it. Maybe. No. It might feel better on the way out than it did on the way in, which it felt pretty good on the way in, so I'm not sure how it could, you know, beat that. But anything is possible with the power of God and fingering. God can touch me in more ways than any other man ever could. God has touched me in more ways than any other man ever could. Yeah, do you go to do you go to church and then when you're praying during the, the pastor's sermon you touch yourself and pretend it's Jesus? Just a little bit. I reach up to my legs, I'm like, yeah, give me the Holy Spirit. Ooh, give me that Holy Spirit. And then, 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 then I, I am I, one with the Lord. I, I am, am the one, one the one, one, the one, and then I come. Uh, yeah, you come in the holy water. That way you can spread your love with everybody who touches yeah. it. I, I start speaking in I start speaking in tongues as I jizz my pants, and then they think it's fine, but in reality I'm just sicko getting off to the religious fanatics. Whoa. Ooh, that's a secret sex chamber. That's where all the secret the secret sex slaves are. Perfect. <laughs> oh my god, it's beautiful. Oh, it's too sexy. They die because they can't handle it. They died from horniness. All the blood rushed into their heartless penises and away from the rest of their body, and it gave them a gave them quite a quite a physical shock. Whoa. The room below is called the Hall of the Cornerstone. No one puts stone in a corner. Our castle has always huh. been safe from worlds that are evil. Thanks to the you know, those Armenian worlds, those dirty, stinky ones out there. 
Oh no, I didn't know Roxas was alive. <laughs> Mini, not you too. It's getting everyone. You just see Rox. Sora looks in the mirror. He's turning into Rox. No, 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 no. I don't hate anyone except Armenians. No. This is the castle's cherished cornerstone. Ooh. Oh. Well, it's a spear. But look. It's spherical. <laughs> spherical. They must it looks the like the the, in the middle easy. inside of it looks like an atom. I wonder what like this with could the mean. the things spinning around it. Yeah, I wonder how it tastes. Like uh, pudding, <gasps> a lot what of pudding. <laughs> Tapioca, no to be specific. Well, well. What you want, well, evil bitch? What have we here? How did you find if this place? Isn't the wretched I could smell the tapioca. Pitiful lackeys. All in good time. Fuck off, Donald. I Donald, what are you doing? Of my That's obviously a hologram, Donald. Patient. Don't you watch Star Trek, you idiot. Come you on. Here, Maybe if you started the series like ah, I told you to three weeks ago, you would know. Fucker. I'm here on a property venture. I want this castle for my own. How you can't you afford it. Not after the renovations I've put in. It's I easily two six five seven. I'll just have to that's, that's two million six hundred fifty-seven thousand. For, for, for those of you not property brothers inclined. You'd better stop right now if you know what's good for you. That was the least non-threatening way to tell someone that. You better stop right now, please. Just as soon as the castle belongs to me. Jokes on you. I'll never put you on the lease. What a <laughs> Yeah, you tell her, Sora. You said it. But if she was willing to put out, I'd do it. It'd be a good hate fuck. Everyone wants a good hate fuck once in a while. Have you ever, have you ever hate fucked or hate jacked off to someone's use it? Almost every day. Yeah. I just look in the mirror and I'm like, Oh, you fucker. Oh, I wish I looked better. But <laughs> Why are you doing this to my life? Something about this mess. Let's ask his advice. We saw him and Hollow Bastion, right? Yeah. Let's go. Oh shit, we gotta go get Merlin to solve these uh, conundrums that are going on. Jesus, I'm getting fucking abilities all over the goddamn place. Yeah, wait till we get those 20 AP boosts. So we're getting that. How many do we have now? We have like, what, 12? I think so. Yeah, uh, 12 of them. 12 to be exact. Well, we need Merlin, so let's head on over where this new episode was just added. We're gonna land right there in his house. Wow. Break the spaceship right in there. That's always not getting up to anything unsavory. Merlin! The castle's in danger. Our sex slaves are loose. Merlin. We need to get them back, case. Merlin. <laughs> oh, I thought, oh, it's, it's you. oh, I thought you were debt collectors. I'm sorry. I owe some money to the IRS. I'm trying to hide from them. You, you didn't tell anyone I live here, do you? Let's talk about the problem. It's magnificent. She's back. Oh, that's fine. I can deal with her. She's not working with the IRS, is she? Yep, and Heartless, too. Oh, they're definitely working with the IRS. I can't trust anyone. Do you guys know anyone who could lend me $40,000? Can I crash at your place for a while? You ain't, you know any female mouse who's down on the luck who wouldn't mind having a weird old man stay around for some sexual favors every once in a while? Perhaps I'd better just see for myself. <laughs> huh. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Interesting. This anal bead is missing quite a lot of segments. This is not good. In fact, I I'm afraid it's quite serious. Oh, shit. Nick, it's serious. It's gonorrhea. <clears throat> it's stage four. Boogity boo. <laughs> What's that? My boy, that is a gateway to a special world. A world? Whoa. I love worlds. In yeah. That world is responsible for what's going on in this castle. How do you that, know that? I'm certain. Oh boy! We knew we could count on you, Merlin. Now uh, about the we sex slaves. <laughs> Please <laughs> tell me you found them. The perpetrators must be stopped, of course. But there's something else to do first. Somewhere These sex slaves. World, there should be another door that's identical to this one. I believe our enemies are utilizing that door. As long as it remains open, the castle will be in grave danger. They can escape this whenever they want. Horror. You must find that door, and when you do, lock it with your keyblade. Lock those sluts in. Got it. 
Gores, I'll kill him if I have to. A body's better than nothing. I'll fucking do it again. While you're there, the nature of that world may tempt you to do something dark. Like each other. You must resist that temptation at all costs. You'll get all manner of diseases by fucking Donald. You'll know Good. soon enough. I want them. I have faith in you, my lads. May Christ be with you, lads. Oh, shit. Well, Caesar, we were presented with a mysterious door that offers nothing but uh, sexual temptations and otherworldly delights. I can see no course of action but to enter in there. Let's do it. In the uh, uh, in the next episode, yeah. Sword didn't even want to turn around. He wanted to keep wanted to keep his eyes locked on that door to see what was left inside. Well, it's breaming with sexual energy. Yep, Look at it. Yep, Goofy's looking at Sora's mouth. Donald's eyeing up his asshole. He's gonna shove his beak or his you know corkscrew penis in there. It's gonna be all. It's gonna be a whole manner of fuckfest going on in that glimmery cro uh, chromescent door. But only in the next episode. You know what they called Donald in prison, Nick, when he was serving time? Uh, the, 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 the corkscrew Corvian? No, Big Bill. They called him Big Bill. Oh, and afterwards he'd say, huh, put it on my bill. And then they'd sit on his face. You know, that's getting too far ahead. We'll, we'll get deeper into Donald's sexual exploitations or sexploitations in the next episode, everyone. Guys, remember, you better like and subscribe because this is it. I'm dying. <laughs> this is it. In the next episode, I will have to found a replacement for Caesar. It might look and sound a lot like him, but mind you, it'll be a completely different one, and he will be oh so uh, ready to experience the sexual favors that are waiting behind this door. I just want to say thank you to everyone who's been watching these episodes, and I'm just, I'm just really happy that I came for the ride. Yep, then maybe you'll come next time.